Hi guys, John with you here. Uh, today's video has nothing to do with real estate, with crypto, or making money at all, but it is uh, part of something that's very important, which is maintaining our health. Uh, many people here in Ontario now are starting to get their second doses of uh, the vaccine. Uh, when my girlfriend and I went in for our first dose, we managed to get Pfizer, which we're very happy about. Uh, the second dose, however, we had to go with Moderna, or maybe we didn't have to, we could have waited longer and gotten a scheduled dose of uh, Pfizer as our second one. I, I felt a need to share our experiences, just so you know what's ahead, uh, because nobody knows exactly what's going on <clears throat> with uh, these side effects because it's a brand new drug. So when we got our vaccines, the next day, uh, we both got sick. Uh, she, my girlfriend, she woke up to the chills. Um, I, I couldn't figure it out because we we're both sleeping with just a sheet and she asked me to go get the comforter and lay it upon her. And then an hour later, the cover <laughs> was off and the fan was blasting directly on her. So she was hot, cold, hot, cold. Uh, I, for my part, woke up fine for the first hour or so, and then I started to get body aches. Um, I had the body aches, started to feel the chills, especially when I got out of the shower. Oh my God, like I had the chills like you wouldn't believe. My teeth were chattering, everything. Uh, I was so, and then I lapsed into a fever, and then back again, and also uh, vomited. So I got very nauseous at one point. It was pretty bad. Uh, then the fatigue would set in periodically and say around 2 p.m. Like all of it went away for me. It all went away and I started to feel great and I was feeling completely normal as if nothing had happened. However, for my girlfriend, it's a different story. Uh, so one disclosure I should say is that she's allergic to penicillin. Now, I've looked things up and so far as they claim, uh, people who are allergic to penicillin shouldn't have any kind of reactions. However... Uh, this is now two days later since we've had the vaccine. Uh, my girlfriend, it's uh, 2 p.m. right now. She went back to bed. She's just completely drained, completely exhausted. Uh, this morning started with us going to the hospital because the rash that she had on her body uh, was still the size of small pimples uh, the night before. But when I woke up this morning and I saw like the rash, it was like just patches, like some as big as my hand, like all over, and I got worried. So before we even had coffee, I just said, get up, we're going to the hospital. We didn't even shower or anything, we just went straight to the hospital. Uh, the doctor there, unfortunately, uh, was an older man who doesn't seem to be uh, too inclined to acknowledge any possible adverse effects coming from the vaccine. Uh, so that's unfortunate. He did prescribe her um, this one drug. I don't have the prescription sheet in front of me, but he advised her to wait for three days for the extreme rash to start to subside before going to buy that prescription. So overall, um, from what I'm seeing, I'd advise you if it's within your reason, if you had Moderna the first time, get Moderna. Uh, we suspect that mixing the two was not quite as uh, easy as the health officials claim, but we can't prove that. Even the health officials seem kind of perplexed by it all. So if you can avoid mixing, I'd suggest it. Uh, I felt nothing like this with my first dose of Pfizer. I just had like a sore arm. That's it, like just a sore arm and the soreness went away by mid-afternoon the next day. Uh, so what I experienced with Moderna and what my girlfriend's still going through with Moderna, it's just like, no way. <laughs> so hopefully if there is another pandemic, we have learned that lesson. So I hope this video has helped. And uh, if you do have any extreme reactions, go to the hospital, don't take any chances. This is still, a brand new thing when you consider its age. Nobody knows for sure, so don't take any risks. I hope you enjoyed this video.